Hey, uh, what is up guys? Welcome back to another video in this Django tutorial series. And this is going to be a short video where you will learn how you can handle the static files. So uh, to handle the static files, in the last video we just wrote it inside the style tag over here. And this is not how you should do it. So for that, inside a main folder, just create another folder saying static. Inside static, create another folder saying CSS and inside CSS, we'll write main.css. Okay, so uh, we'll get rid of these and then we'll paste those over to our main.css. And then in our base.html, we'll link it to that file. So, so before that, we need to go to settings.py inside movie review. And at the end, we should provide a static root. And it's going to be os.path.join base directory and we'll say static files. Okay. So uh, let's run this. And it doesn't have any problems. So in the base.html, we'll uh, load the static files first because we need to load static load static files and then we'll do link and then the link is going to be static and the folder that is css and the name of the file so this should work but before that we need to run a command saying python manage.py collect static And this will collect all the static files. This is right now collecting the static files for Bootstrap. And then let's try to run it on the server to check if it's working or not. So we'll try to reload it and then view page source. And let's see if it works. Yep, there you go. It's loading from CSS forward slash main.css. So to check, to really confirm that it's working, we'll just comment this out and then we'll say background is sorry background is red okay and let's reload it and there you go the background is red so uh, we'll get rid of these and we'll uncomment it and it should be working and that is how you you know, handle static files in Django. So you have to update the static root and then create a static folder, CSS and main.css and link it in the base.html by loading it first and then giving it the link to it. So that was it for this video and we'll discuss more about it in the next video. Till then, thanks for watching. If you have any problems, just let me know in the comment section below. Thank you.